Hello! If you want to make charms and gems without resin, these hot glue charms are a good alternative. You can make them into pins, jewelry and more. So here's all you will need. And let's begin! First of all, we need to shape the charms with wire. Here I'm kind of mass producing round charms. This is very soft wire, so it's quite easy. You can make all kinds of shapes with any type of wire, just corners are more tricky to fill later on. Now you can place your shapes on different surfaces for different effects. Aluminium foil is great because you can color it with sharpies and you can crinkle it or leave it smooth. Then you fill it with glue and try not to touch the foil too much because it gets hot. I'm using really transparent glue sticks here, but even with other glue sticks you can make decent charms and gems. Next trim the excess foil. The foil can peel off on the back, so I recommend sealing the edges with nail polish. You can be creative and come up with your own designs. An alternative are shiny pieces of soda cans, which give the gemstones a nice shifting effect as well. And you know I love soda cans. You can also use different kinds of paper, which works well, but sometimes the paper warps and sometimes it doesn't. I don't know why. Anyways, you can really personalize the charms with paper. If you want clear gemstones, just place the wire on non-stick surfaces like aluminium foil, silicone or baking paper. Whether you use a matte or shiny surface will determine the transparency. You can paint the bottom, bottom using acrylic paint or nail polish for example. The glue gets the glue gets <laughs> the glue gets cloudy the more you touch it, so I like to coat it with nail polish. If you want to glue the gems onto something, you can use super glue or more hot glue. By adding a little loop to your wire shape, your charm turns into a pendant. You can make an easy ring using more hot glue and wire. And if you want to make a pin from scratch, you can glue on a thumbtack or make your own pin needle from strong wire. To close the pin, you can just use a piece of a glue stick. Lastly, not every charm will come out great, so just keep trying. And you can use nail polish to fix some charms. Or you can hide your mistakes with glitter. If you want a shout out in my next video, you can leave me a super thanks comment now, which is a highlighted comment that you can buy with a donation. Speaking of thanks, thank you for watching and check out this video with more hot glue charms. Bye!